Now I'm going to show applying a circuit space template against the board that I've auto clustered. So I'm going to apply a template. Choose circuit space apply templates. We saved off a cam four four gig double sided. Push it over to the right. You can actually, if you have other clusters or other templates that you want to apply at the same time, you can also do that. Then in our options panel, we'll select all the parts in the design. We can choose which which uh, algorithm we want to use, whether we want to strict, equivalent. If we want to use channel prefixes or suffixes, we can also apply templates based on, on that as well. And then we're going to turn on enable partial match so that if we don't get all the parts, we at least get uh, the, the parts that we can find. And we could select uh, create symbols for unmatched. This would actually create placeholder parts in the positions of the missing parts that we don't find. Also, if I had a pre-placed uh, fixed components, say for instance I had um, an Ethernet section or a USB port or something like that that had a fixed fixed component, we could actually say place relative to fixed. But this particular design, we don't actually have that, so uh, we won't do that. And then I'll say done, and circuit space will go off and apply that, that one template against the design and create as many copies of that circuit as possible. When it's completed, a batch control panel will open up and we'll apply the results. Our resulting clusters will end up off the board, off the bottom of the board. And now we have we have four resulting clusters from applying that one template. And that's all it takes to apply a template in circuit space.